Right, off we go. Hope you can hear me. The microphone should be there. I've got to be careful because there's loads of leaves, so I can't see what's on the floor. We're going the same way as we went yesterday. So this is where I went to get some footage with my cousin. I'm trying out my new helmet. We've got some people with a dog. Be careful around here. Again. Now this grass is dodgy as well. Let's see how it does. It's suspension. So far so good. There's two dogs. Oh, the leaf. You alright? Didn't see the leaf. Hiya. Oh, yeah. Of course, people can't see my face now. That's going to be a bit weird for them. But, there we are. camera seems to be holding up, off we go again so we're going to go all the way to the end of this towpath I'm going to see how it compares to the ice scooter i9 when it goes over the bumps obviously I assume it's going to be good I'll also try and get a bit of speed up at some point I am in the full power mode at the moment Let's also make sure that's the back brake I'm pushing, not the front brake. Yep, yeah. back brake's on the left. I don't want to be skidding off. So about this helmet. Oh, the helmet is from AliExpress. It's only about 20 quid. Basically, I wanted something that covered my full face so I could pretend to be a badass. Uh, sadly, it's not a full face helmet though, it's just got a full face visor. I was looking at other things, full face helmets with big visors, but they seem to be quite expensive and uh, take a while to arrive. So this is, this is pretty cool, what's the 24? Whoa, hoo -hoo. That was actually, I just wasn't prepared for that, but it was fine. Gotta watch out for QP Pencil Room as well. Whee! I don't know the leaf. Thank you. Thanks. I get rid of the leaf at the end. I'm going to cross the road. Get to the end of the across the road. I'm going to have to get some speed up here. 22. Come on. 24. Come on. Light as a butterfly. 25. Come on. Get to 26. 26, please. Thanks. Right, let's go up here. Oh, there's a lot of people around. Considering how cold it is, five degrees, which isn't good for the battery, remember. Now, yesterday we did about 10 miles. It was more than half left. It's in full power mode, full speed mode, which obviously ruins battery performance. So far, I'm liking the helmet. Thank you. Right, let's get across here. Let's get into here. Toasty! It's doing all right. Still recording. Thank you. Thank you. Right, and off we go. 
Oh, there's a big massive root here yesterday. Be careful, watch. Be careful of that. There's that. I mean, I'm sure it can cope with the root. In this nice autumn weather, what's the autumn weather like like by you? Usually, I can't stand autumn weather, but we haven't had a ton of rain recently, so it actually looks quite nice. Let's go. On the mud path. This good is natural habitat. Someone's coming towards me. Honestly. People are so good. Coming out on a Sunday for a, a stroll. Through the pretty tree thing. Whee! Oh man. It's such a nice thing to do, just go out in the morning. Got the mosquito thing. This might be where Rick fell off yesterday, or nearly fell off. Because he is a bit of a daredevil. I thought that was someone chilling by the park then, which is the, it's like a log or something. Let's see what this hill's like. Let's not get a run up. Here we go. It's quite a steep hill. And we're up here. And off we go. Right, I'm going to have to get some speed up now. Oh, there we go. I think my face ripped off. Come on. Come on. Speed now. Of course, I can't go shooting under the bridgey thing down here because there's gates everywhere. So gotta watch out for that. There is a section on this where I should be able to get some speed up. But although I've done, I've already done the first impressions of this uh, iX4, and I am mightily impressed with it, considering it's not a mega powerful scooter in terms of wattage. 500 watts isn't massively powerful. You've got videos of people with scooters that go 6,000 watts, even more than that. But this, if I was commuting to work on this, this would be more than enough. And down the tunnel we go. Take it down here. Oh, it's good. It's good. Compared to the uh, the i9, which is absolutely fine for getting you around on flat ground, it just it's punchier, it's more instant. The second you push down on the throttle, you go. Woo, woo. It's really nice. Yeah, I bet I'm scary in this uh, helmet. I mean, like when I'm wearing my other helmet, people can see my face. I say, "Good morning." People reply. People, I don't think anyone's responded to me yet. All right, let's get round here. Let's see what speed we can go. Now, Rick got up to 28 under the tunnel. Let's see if we can do that. And 22. Down a bit, the wind. Oh, the hum is here, I don't know. I've got a brake. I don't know how to have to brake, I'm just checking on that. Whoa, play six. Oh. Maybe I went the other way. This is slightly downhill coming back. Can I get this over 20, well, 26 down a hill? But I did break just beforehand because I got a bit scared. You know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn around, go into that tunnel again, and I'm gonna kick myself off. You ready? Kick off, kick off. Two, 22, 
23, 24. Tunnel coming. Oh, bump coming. 24. Hope there's no one coming. There's no one coming. 29, 29, 29. <laughs> I don't know if you saw that. Right, this has been nice and steady. These are cool, these are. I think they're called like magic arms or something. Right, let's go push up. Oh, helmet. Uh, obviously, if I do face plants, then this helmet's not going to be as good as my other helmet. The battery at the moment, full throttle. I suppose it's the it's a battery sag, isn't it? It's three at the moment. When I let go, it'll probably go back up to five. And it's pushing me along at 22, 23. Now, the people who prepared, repaired the scooter for me, because it came with a, a broken um, broken controller, Microtech in Wolverhampton, Dudley Road. Microtech or Micro Scooter. I think Micro Scooter is where they sell scooters. Micro, Microtech is where they repair scooters, repair phones. So, um, Yeah, they, they said they could actually upgrade this to a thousand watts for about 200. I am tempted, what do you reckon? If anyone wants to leave a comment about that, should I get this, after I've done all the review and stuff like that, should I get it upgraded to a thousand watts? Push, push, push down here. Feel like Fred Flintstone. I'm on a proper road. No cars coming. 23. This road's terrible. This is running 24. Right. I mean, people apologising to the illegal e scooter. I'm the only one doing something wrong here. Darn you British laws. But overall I'm very satisfied with this. I did read a review of someone who got the scooter wouldn't go above 27 miles an hour. Now considering the top speed is meant to be 28 miles an hour or uh, around 45 kilometers per hour. They were very receptive. They said in the review, the person said that they actually sent a new scooter and didn't demand they reply, return the other scooter. So customer support seems decent. I mean, I'm back home now. Nearly. I think I'll take the roadway back like I did before. Oop. Morning, thank you. Right. And then just uh, hope we don't see any police. That's the thing, I'd, I'd love to take one of these really far out. But it's a bit so paranoid. Right, up a bit of a hill now. Ooh. 14. 15 17 So I'm above where my unicycle starts conking out 20 How far is this trip I wonder? It's a nice little pace, isn't it? Really, 
Now this road isn't that steep right now, but it is uphill and the wind's on me. And I'm heavy. For 21 at the moment, not too bad. You gonna you gonna see me? Yes you are. I should probably bend my knee a bit. And on the home straight to indicate Cruise control is really cool. You get the same speed for five seconds, and then it'll start matching that speed. And as soon as you touch the brakes, it will turn itself off. Let's uh, let's see if I can do cruise control at like a tiny bit of throttle. Let's just get past that guy. Yeah, I'm not getting. Come on. Maybe it works in speed rather than power. Well, I'm back home, and that's it. I forgot to say goodbye. Thanks for watching the EVRC. If you like these kind of chatty rides, uh, don't forget to subscribe. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button, and hopefully I'll see you next time. See ya.